pizza. Oh my gosh, a rocket. This is better than pizza. Please tell me, should I make a full video of me watching the entire series while shit-faced? Today's the day! Do a video taping yourself. Are you? Are you? Butt lovers. The amount of videos it took us to get to this point, like the family tree of videos that we have here, is just incredible. I, I love to see it. Definitely check out any of the vids on screen after this one. Today we are exploring the world of Beanie Babies 2.0 and its spokesperson, Snoots. Snoots the dog. A Clifford the Big Red Dog ripoff if I ever did see one. It's also a long series, so I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to get through everything today. Dare I say there might even be a part two to this. But first things first, you already know what time it is. It's time for some peanut butter whiskey. <laughs> and a good old-fashioned, a drinking montage. Snooze. Tie. That's short for tired. I had a joke prepared and then I got drunk and I forgot it and it's actually killing me. I've been trying to remember it for the past, it feels like 30 minutes. It's probably realistically been eight. Having the peanut butter whiskey was risky. I don't know what fucking rhymes like that. It had a rhyme like that. Whatever, let's watch. <laughs> I'm new around here, so I think I should tell you a little bit about myself. That's literally just how I sound when I have my sinus infections that happen every two months. <laughs> I like... Biscuits, they're delicious, and I love the letter B, 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 B. Ooh, ooh, and I love to sniff people's feet. Uh, okay. <laughs> I like lots of stuff. You know what's <laughs> the worst part is like clearly they're going, they're, they're leading into the fact that he's a dog, and then he's like, and then he's just like using his hands, and he's like, and guess what? I got these opposable thumbs to grab your little toesies. And like, God damn. But know what I like best is my new soccer room. Uh -huh. <laughs> This was like a mini game in Beanie Babies 2.0. I think yeah. I remember playing, oh God, there's that sheep that I love so goddamn much in the background. Oh, I wish I still had that the little stuffed animal. But um, the games weren't good from what I remember. Check it out right now, okay? You have to, go. Stop looking at me, go look now. Stop it, I'm go play this stinking game, go. Go play the game, go. How go long is this gonna go on for? If you don't go play, I'm oh gonna tell God. your mom. <laughs> go play now. Okay, please. Go, go play now. I want to play soccer. Please play with me. I know this is supposed to just be commercials, but like it actually has a storyline after a while. This is just uncomfortable. He was like, you better check out my soccer room, bitch. And then I was like, all right, damn. And he's like, no, bitch is just why I say female dog. And I was like, okay, but I'm a human and that's kind of like offensive in our world. Anyway, did they just upload this on YouTube? I assume so because like, oh, or on their website, like on their website and YouTube, this was not an advertisement on TV. That makes sense. It's got that like kind of earlier-ish YouTube yeah, he's, flash Yeah, he's a vlogger. He's a vlogger. Yeah. A dog -er. Okay. Kaylee wants to know, what happens to the beaties when we retire them? Well, you know what, Kaylee? I don't tell too many people this. They fucking die! <laughs> they join that tie in the sky, you know what I mean? The big tie in the sky. There's actually a secret country club in Beanie Land, and they play golf all day in really ugly pants. Heh. <laughs> So what are you guys doing this weekend? Oh, how about this I hate summer? this post specifically. Are you, <laughs> you should be done with school. At least, I, I hope. I didn't have to go to school. Haha. <laughs> they don't take an educational approach, which is fine. You don't have to. But you also don't have to shit all over school. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Hi, Peanut2997. I would love to be your best friend. You're so sweet. Oh, I don't like that. Big. You're my best friend now, but you can only be my best friend if you buy three more Beanie Babies. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's kind of just like weird. <laughs> that's so weird. <laughs> I would skip this part, but I need to listen to make sure that I very well could be one of the people that he shouts out. And I just, I need to hear it for myself. I'm oh, so sorry. I'm so sorry, but we have to sit through this. That'd be wild. If Snoot says Athena, the P in Athena might stand for to literally piss myself because I'm so excited. And Gus Monkey? Um, you are going so many places this summer, and I am jealous of you. Awesome, awesome places like Orlando and Disney World. I don't think you should say what? that. That's, no, that's something kind that. Of personal information there. And Pink Athena, you live at. <laughs> Your social security number is. I wish I could go with you. Ew. So you want to know why I'm red, huh? Well. 
I play in Beanie Land outside all day long. I chase sheep and ducks and sometimes stray golf balls. <laughs> so I'm sunburned. Ow. What? That sucks. So he's actually like white? A white man? No! Also, he doesn't have fur. That's just his skin. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. SPF stands for snoots. Pretty fucking burnt. Don't be sad, Haley. I know you miss Gage, but everything will be okay. That's oh, really sad. That's really sad. I'd like to say hello to my friends Carolyn and Bretta. Oh, and I also wanted to tell you guys what I do to cheer myself up. For a lot of kids, like, being like, Snoots, I'm really sad right now. Everything's going to shit, Snoots. Like, snoots, whoa. the mental health care in this country is terrible, and you are my psychiatrist now. <laughs> I like to play outside. I like to read a book, which is really hard because I'm a dog and I can't read. Well, you said you dropped out of school, like, the second episode, so that actually that would have helped. <laughs> the funniest thing is that I think that the voice actor's trying to go for a little kid, and then he laughs like like a 50-year-old smoker. <laughs> <laughs> and remember, kids, don't forget to give me your letters. <laughs> <laughs> Live from the BLN Studios, this is a Beanie Land News. Bro, sorry, all the memories are coming back now. Sorry, all the memories are coming back now, because this is when shit got real, I think. <laughs> I'm here at Beanie Land Lake, where sightings of a mysterious creature have been stirring up a lot of incitement among local beanies. Is it a dolphin? I feel like it's a dolphin. <laughs> but I think these beanies will be keeping all their eyes peeled from now on. I knew it, I knew it, I remember this. I did, I fucking watched this when I was younger, dude. Let's get some reaction from local beanies. What do you think? Well, I think it stinks. My mama don't let me go swimming. And I'm hot. I ain't scared. Well, isn't that lovely? I ain't scared. Do you guys think it's a whale? Some think it's a dolphin? Or, or a sea monster? Okay, whoever suggested it was a sea monster clearly wasn't looking in the background close enough of the first thing. It's so funny because obviously they're laying it on really thick because it's for children. I was probably realistically nine or ten and some people were commenting that were like six or five. Some people were probably like, oh, it's a sea monster. And I was like, no, look at the background. I probably spammed the comments. I was like, it's a dolphin, guys. God. These were your first YouTube comment section fights. Yeah, because I pay attention to the lore. Well, it looks like I need to figure out what to use for bait here. Candy? No. And a peanut butter to Hey, that's my sandwich for lunch. Eat it. Snoots oh, ate, I'm, I'm afraid. Right. So it looks like we just have some candy and fish tickles to use as bait. I hope the monster likes that. You think the monster like fish sticks in the mouth? <laughs> Honestly, I'm just picturing little Athena because she was so annoying. Like, if you think older Athena's annoying, boy oh boy. Boy oh freaking boy. Um, I was probably like, THE FISH! All my friends suggested that we use the fish tickles as bait to catch the monster. I was attacked by hungry seagulls. We were trying to get rid of them with our oars. But they took the last fish tickle anyway. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was going to be like, and then they took our oars. <laughs> we were stranded out at sea. No oars, no fish tickles. For Oops. 40 days and 40 nights. What? We sailed alone in the sea. Is this some kind of fucking Moby Dick thing? I don't know. Did you just make that up? I just made that up. He's very creative. <laughs> Check out his channel, Shockorama, for more fun stuff. <laughs> okay, so I accept Venmo. <laughs> and then to add to all of the problems already, we dropped the oars in the water. Okay, so yeah. So we were lost. lost at sea. Vines and I were sitting there scared and alone. And suddenly, we heard something in the water moving toward us. The creature, it came right up to the boat. We thought we were done for. The, the creature, it was pushing us with its nose. We held on for dear life. We squished our eyes shut so hard, and then, and then it stopped. We squished we our, our eyes. eyes. It rescued us. We turned to see the monster that had saved us, but it was gone. The only thing the monster left was an empty fishicle stick on the side of the boat. The creature, it wasn't actually a monster at all. It was a dolphin. You were right. Wait, if you said that you didn't Wait. see it, like, how would you know? Yeah, something's not adding up here. Hey, guys, we have some super amazing things happening in Beanie Land, and I wanted to impress you with a magic show. Abracad Jellyfish! <laughs> 
That's that? terrifying. Okay, so Snoots has reality altering magical abilities, and I really feel like you shouldn't probably. This is very disturbing to learn this late in the game. Hi, Bing. What are you doing? Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. I. I... Uh, Bing is, is using to the. To the. To the. His brain! Bing is using his brain to talk to me. <laughs> to Lil. To Lil. To Lil. His brain! <laughs> A magical mishap in Beanie Land is causing disastrous results. BLM cannot even enter Beanie Land because of the amount of gum blocking our way. Snoots cannot be found for questioning. He is the prime suspect because he is the only one in possession of a magic wand. He uh, would. He would. He would, first of all. <laughs> Second of all, can you imagine the plot twist? You're showing this to a bunch of kids. It's like, Snoots has killed five people. We can't find him. Do you know where he is? If you have any tips on where he could be, call this number and it's just 911. <laughs> the mishap seems to have caused catastrophic changes all over the island. Arrest. Him. Even Beanie Land citizens have changed. Ew! Hey guys! Hey guys! Let's play the shut the fuck up game! You first! <laughs> Your turn! I'm not going back to jail. I'm so glad you liked the magic show. That was so much fun. But you have to hear what happened afterwards. You're not gonna believe it. Long story short. I'm on the run, but I love going on runs because I'm a dog. <laughs> Don't tell the police where I am. Can you spell escaped convict? <laughs> so my new friends and I, we decided to go out and get gumballs because they're so delicious. Since we didn't have any money, Ew. where are those pockets coming from? Why? So there we were in the sky with our faces stuck to giant bubbles. And out of nowhere came those seagulls. Huh? Those pesky seagulls wanted some gum. So they started, they started popping our bubbles. Oh no! W what happened? Did you die? Time more like time. <laughs> so there I was, stuck in a giant web of bubble gum in a tree. And, and I couldn't see any of my friends. So I looked down at the ground, and guess what I saw? My, my magic wand. The real one. Someone switched my wand before the magic show. <gasps> that must have been why all the beanies turned into strange creatures. All weekend, I've been running around Beanie Land and, and trying to find everyone and change them back for you guys. The plot thickens. It thickens, but also, like, I don't know if this was their initial plan or if they were trying a rebrand and everyone hated it. Did you see what those other designs looked like? Because they were really ugly. Oh. Yeah. Huh. I don't know what was up with that. Based on what I remember from the comments of my Webkin's knockoffs video, which you should definitely watch. It's a very funny video. I'm drunk, but I still remember to self-promote. <laughs> I have my priorities, okay? Drunk Athena lost her train of thought. Here's the comment, though. That's like next level backpedaling. Oh, they I backpedaled like fucking pros. I love it, actually. Snoots loves swimming. I like to go swimming. That must have been why all the beanies turned into strange creatures. That must be why the beanies look like fucking weenies! <laughs> I tried to find everyone and change them back for you guys. I like how he's not even saying for them because they were changed. <laughs> like, for you guys. Because you thought they were so ugly before. You were like, who are these ugly fucks? <laughs> and the beanies were like, I actually kind of like it. But I was like, no. Think about our fans. They think you look ugly, so I'm going to think about it. We can't have the kids thinking you look ugly. Live from the BLN Studios, this is a Beanie Land News Update. seems that we now have a villain among us. There are several suspects in question. We got a sussy villain that needs to be ejected from Beanie Land. Could it be an evil fairy in a stump? Does Snoots have an evil twin? Maybe it's a tie girl. Or quite possibly those pesky seagulls. <laughs> or was it possibly a tie girl? That's so cute. They were like, we're going to advertise our other product, but we'll do it in like a sneaky little way. <laughs> we have a little banter. That's cute. I like that. I like that a lot. But anyway, who stole the wand? It was the seagulls. It was obviously the seagulls. Next storyline. The birds work for the bourgeoisie. <laughs> Don't. This is the first bill and exclusive. We're following trails of, of what looks to be lily pads. They're falling all around us. We're trying to see where they're coming from. What is this? Wow, that sucks to be you guys, I guess. They literally were like, oh, is this gonna be like some new friend? Or is this gonna be whatever? This is a frog you've known since the beginning. Throwing a party that you weren't invited to, dude. That sucks. 
This is probably an advertisement for like new games on the website, I'm oh, guessing. Oh yeah, yeah, Or um, an event that's just happening for a month or something. But still, you'd think Snoots would know. They're treating him yeah. like the fucking mayor, sending him out to discover dolphins and shit, and then they don't even invite him to the parties. That's so awkward. And the news team, dude. Yeah. It seems like they were just like, this is for regular people. Get your your bureaucratic hands off of our little fucking festival where we throw lily pads at your face. We should go see. Oh. This is a Beanie Land news update with award-winning anchorman Chester Fuzzington III. He comes on here, he's like, guys, turns out we weren't invited to a party. If you guys want to make me sad, you succeeded. <laughs> Let's check out the Fiona 2008, Honey Pie. 2008, yes, Olympic the Beanie Olympics. Fiona? Like, do you remember this? Thanks, Chet. Welcome to our live coverage of Beanie Olympics training. Pops is trying to get distance on his water balloon toss. I hate that that character is just a dad. What's up with that? I, th I thought they were supposed to be little pets, and they're like, yeah. and this guy, I took him from his family. I took him because mine is an absent father. <laughs> just an endless string of absent fathers. <laughs> That's funny. We now go to Fiona Honeypot, reporting live from the opening ceremonies. Welcome to the Beanie Olympics opening ceremonies. Ming has been making his way across Beanie Land to light the torch and get the ceremony underway. Oh dear, it seems somebody needs to go wake up that silly panda. Thanks, Fiona. Now we're going to check in with Snoots to see how his training is going. His training, isn't it today? Hey guys! So, I've been practicing my balance, but, but look what I can do! Do you have to make that sound to do it? Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> ew! What the? What? Ew, 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 oh, ew, I don't ew, like ew, 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 ew. No. no. I think, I think no. when I was younger, I was scared of that too. I'm making shit up. I'm fully making shit up, but it feels real in my head right now. No, I actually don't think I like that because I don't like it now and I don't think I would have liked it back then. And I think I watched this back then. I don't think I like that. I think Snoots should have eaten that egg for breakfast too. So I decided to make breakfast. It like, it actually gives me like heartburn and I don't like it. I don't like the way it looks. I don't like the way it like smiles. I don't like it at all. Guys, there's so much Beanie Babies 2.0 content. There's 108 episodes. Yeah. And I genuinely want to watch more. Listen, listen, if you leave it a comment, do not watch any more of this on camera. Just get drunk and watch this on your own time, you, you little bitch. Honestly, like that would be a little bit mean, but I value your feedback. I have a YouTube channel now. Like, that's just me. And it's called Shockorama. Ben just came out with another amazing video. There's only two videos on their channel so far, but I, I think it's a really strong start. It's a really strong niche. Definitely check out Ben's videos. Next week is Doodle Bops lore. Week after that is fucking <laughs> Frindle. And then we're in August, baby. So we're just gonna keep this, this train moving. I hope you have a great day. Hey everybody, it's Snoots! This song slaps harder than that lily pad on my face! Just fucking listen to it! Snoots! Olympic winner, skin cell killer, permanently red from the sun. Birth the weird chicken, will he ever fit in? His main character arc has just begun! <laughs> Telling everyone where they're traveling. <laughs> Dolphins saved him. Webkins hate him. Should I do a part two or stop this?